Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, I don't know if this video is gonna be first or not, so I apologize for saying that if it's not first, but um, we are getting ready for our across the country road trip uh, 2021. Actually, it's our first road trip together. So my husband and I are going on a road trip for his birthday. We are doing, wow, that's really loud, so I hope you can hear me. We're doing 11 states in nine days, you guys. So yes, I am documenting this so that you guys can follow us on our crazy trip and see how we're doing that in nine days. taking his first venture outside of California. Is that right? I think so. I don't think we've really gone anywhere with him. Maybe, did we go to the river? I don't even think so. So this might be his ver first voyage trip outside of California. So I'm super excited about that. Um, and we are just getting ready with a new wash and then we're all packed up. I do have to take my two dogs, my pit bull, Chevelle, and our boxer, Cheeto, into um, our little PetSmart doggy motel, hotel, whatever, the Holiday Inn. Um, and they're gonna be there for a little bit. So we're totally gonna miss them, but because we're staying at a couple of our timeshares, we can't take them. And so, yeah, we're gonna miss them because nine days without them is gonna be really hard. So anyway, you guys, I hope you can join us on the rest of these videos. And yes, I promise that <laughs> the sound is gonna be way better and the lighting is gonna be way better on all these other videos. So we'll see you guys on the road. Hello, hello, you guys. We are on the last day before our trip. Why do I call it the last day? Because we've been prepping for this trip. Lots to be done. We've been shopping for our snacks and things that we're gonna take in the truck. Um, but we gotta take these cuties into the little pet hotel. Say hi, Chevelle. That's our pit baby, Chevelle. And Cheeto. Hi. They're so cute, right? Anyway. So this is uh, our little trip to the pet hotel and they're super excited to just be in the car. I don't think they realize we're gonna be gone for nine days, so I'm not sure they're gonna be excited about that. But it's like the final countdown. I'm just gonna drop them off. It's about two o'clock right now in the afternoon. My husband had to work, so I'm um, trying to look at the road. Sorry if I'm not looking at you guys, but um, my husband had to work. So we're gonna be leaving right after work on a Friday night to start this road trip. So it's gonna be crazy because we don't have a lot of time. Um, this is what happens when you still have a traditional job and have to ask for a vacation. <laughs> you might not have it. So anyway, uh, we're super excited to just get on the road and have a good time regardless of we, what we get to do or not get to do. Um, it's gonna be fun. So I hope that you guys enjoy watching our adventure as much as we enjoy sharing it with you guys so we will see you in the next video well I say the next video but we're just gonna add all these videos together so that um, we don't have a bunch of choppy little two-minute videos and stuff for you guys so anyway um, yeah that's it we'll see you in a second Okay, seriously, this is exactly why we're going on a road trip to the Midwest and back east, kind of. Well, I guess South Carolina is on the east. But anyway, oh my gosh, hello. Barely just got on the freeway and it's two o'clock in the afternoon on a Friday. Oh, I can't wait for roads that are open with trees lining the streets. Bridges. Uh, yeah, can't wait. Hey guys. 
guys, so we are starting our crazy road trip, 11 states in nine days, me and my hubby Kyle. And we got traffic already. <laughs> um, yeah, we got traffic already. As you guys saw, I took the dogs into the pet hotel and as soon as I got on the freeway, there was massive traffic like at 2 p.m. Um, and of course, you know anything about where we live in Orange County if you try to take the 57 or the 91 anywhere on a Friday night it's pretty bad but we got to do what we got to do because we only have a certain amount of time so we're just gonna stick through the traffic and get through there um, we are riding in our awesome Maximus the Jeep um, Gladiator his first trip out to a bunch of different states so hopefully we'll get some time out on some trails and record that I'm excited about that because we've done a couple here in California but getting out somewhere else where all of you guys do trails is super exciting for us so hopefully we'll have some time to do that um, that's why we're driving as much as we are so we can get to where we want to go and do the things that we want to do so anyway um, that's it for right now we're getting going on Friday night and then we will check with you guys when we get to our first destination. Talk to you later. So we made it to Scottsdale, Arizona. Um, what time did we get here? Like 11.45, I would think. Um, traffic was horrible coming out of Orange County, of course. Um, but we got here. We are staying at our condo um, in Scottsdale. And... We are going on a couple hours of sleep, but that's okay because that is the plan. Since we're doing this crazy road trip, um, you know, we're gonna sleep when we die, right? So we're gonna have fun on this road trip. It's all about getting to our destination, seeing our friends, seeing some of the cool places that we want to see and go and do some of the trails and things that we wanna do. So. Um, sleep is not top priority on this trip, but we do want to get some sleep and feel good and energized. So anyway, um, it is now the next day. So it is Saturday um, morning. It's about, I don't know, 3.15 a.m. Um, I've got my beautiful fire behind me. I'm trying to warm up because as soon as we got in here, I took a shower and um, washed my hair and then I wanted to get to sleep. And you know, when you're driving and you're awake and you're good, it's kind of hard to get to sleep. Well, not so much for Kyle. He literally fell asleep like within minutes because he was so tired, but he had also been up since like 4.30. Um, Friday morning so he knocked out and then it took me a while probably about half an hour or so to go to sleep an hour maybe so I'm really literally getting two hours sleep um, but I feel good and I just needed to put my feet up and let my body relax and go to sleep so um, we are in our awesome condo I love it love it yeah that's a little messy over there but anyway um, it is so cool, you guys. We've got our full kitchen and everything. It's super nice. I didn't even look to see what was outside because it was dark. So I, I, I'm pretty sure it's still dark right now. Let's see what we've got going on outside. If we can even see anything at all. Oh, we've got a really nice patio. Do I dare turn the light on? That is the question. Okay, super cute little patio out here. Nice little table for four. And we have a view of the pool. So pretty. Okay. 
Okay, so second stop on our road trip is Waco, Texas, of course. Who doesn't want to go see the silos over at Magnolia? So we're going to go head over there, and um, then later in the evening, we're going to head over to TNT Ranch and go visit some friends of ours um, that just moved out to Texas. So we're super excited, and we will see you on the road. Good morning. It is 6 a.m. Sun is starting to come up. It looks beautiful on this road, so I just wanted to share it with you guys. We are leaving Tucson, Arizona area. Headed towards El Paso right now. So it is a glorious morning on the road. Thank you, Highway Patrol. 